Thanks everyone. Have a good time. Started this morning with Ravi Fabry. I'd like to ask a question, please let us know. Thompson. Hey, congrats on the deal, Fabs. That's the second one you've signed here, though. So it says something about you mm -hmm. wanting to stay here. What is that? Um, yeah, no, that definitely that was uh, the plan going into the season. And, um, you know, ever since I came here, really. And, um, you know, it's just such a great group that we got going in there and, you know, improving each and every year. And, um, you know, it's fun to be a part of, and I wanted to be a part of it. What does it mean to you to be a part of something that's growing and rebuilding and all the excitement that's around that right now in this city? Yeah, it's, uh, you know, the, the fans have been great. Uh, you know, we've been feeding off uh, what they've been feeling this year. And, um, you know, we're feeling the same way in the room. And um, we're just trying to get better and better every game. And um, it's, like I said, it's, it's fun to be with this group right now and working uh, towards what we want to be, you know, in the near future. Thanks, Pat. Please, St. James. Hi, Robbie. What do you remember thinking when you came over in the trade? Um, you know, I was, uh, excited, um, you know, a, a fresh start over here, um, you know, with some familiar faces, it was, uh, it was exciting and, you know, things got off to a good start and, and I've been great ever since. What conversation did you have with Steve at that time? Um, you know, it was basically just, you know, trying to get my career back on track and, uh, playing at the level that, that I know I can play at and, um, you know, and then that was mainly it. And you fit in that age group, <clears throat> excuse me, with, with Dylan and Tyler and a lot of the other guys, you know, early to mid 20s. What do you what's the sense in the locker room amongst you guys just for how, you know, what you've been able to do this season, uh, just the steady improvement in in helping this team become competitive again? Um, yeah, you know, like I said, uh, you know, not only, uh, you know, Bert Larks and myself, it's a. Uh, you know, a full team effort in there and, and what everyone brings every single night and every day of practice is what's, you know, helping us grow and, um, you know, become a little bit more consistent. And, you know, we still got room for improvement. We all know that in that room and, and what we got to work on. But, um, you know, it's fun coming to the rink every day and doing it with these guys. Lastly, I'm just curious. I know it's not by any means the first contract you've signed, but do you still celebrate in any little way when you get a new contract? Um, Will you yeah, at some I mean, point? Uh, I was on uh, FaceTime with my parents last night and, um, you know, had a nice glass of wine with dinner with my fiance. So, um, you know, it's always, it's always nice to celebrate, even though it's not your first one. Great. Thanks, Ron. John Keating. Hey, Robbie, congrats on the deal. Um, uh, a current question about uh, what didn't go so well for you on the road trip compared to the five game winning streak that, that you guys enjoyed uh, before that what has to be better from what you saw on the road trip? Um, you know, I think our, our starts, um, our starts to the game uh, have to be a lot better, um, you know, to set the tone for the rest of the game and, um, you know, not, not dig ourselves too big of a hole. That's, that's tough to come out of, uh, you know, especially on the road when, when you're in their building. So, um, you know, I think just, you know, from the drop of the puck, you know, playing the way uh, we, we, we did on the road trip in the second and third and, and not waiting. Thanks, man. Good luck tonight. Daniela Bruce. Robbie, congratulations. So I'm just wondering, how much does this relieve any pressure, or do you just you get to relax a little bit playing the rest of the season, knowing that the deal is in place? Yeah, um, I mean, I'm, I'm the type of player that you know I can I just control what I can control, and that's you know how I'm playing, and uh, let all the other noise take care uh, take care of itself. But um, yeah, you know, it, it's definitely just a little bit of weight lifted off the shoulders and. Um, just just able to play now, but um, yeah, just excited to be here for another three after this. And um, obviously, the lines were switched up a little bit with uh, Bert being out, and you got the chance to play alongside Lucas Raymond and Dylan Larkin again. They might might change with Bert being back, but how much did you enjoy playing with them? Yeah, um, you know, Razor's a, a special player, and, he, and he's shown that uh, um, so far this season. It's been uh, fun to watch, and you know, even more fun to play with, and. You know, Larks is Larks. So, uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun, but, um, you know, it's nice to uh, to get Bert back in the lineup now and, um, you know, kind of get back uh, on the winning streak with with uh, him coming back and, you know, Stolze in the near future. Thanks, Thanks everyone. We'll be back shortly with Coach Flashel. Thank you.